Right. So if they attack, they'll do it during my speech, yes? Nothing's guaranteed, sir. But that seems like the strongest possibility. Most of Marley's highest-ranked officers will be gathered for it. That's a rare occurrence. I should mention, in accordance with protocol, we're waiting to determine escape routes till later, lest the information should leak. I'll note that many VIPs will be arriving by carriage. Got it. Seat the officers in a special section. Group them, preferably at the edge of the crowd. Is this really what you want to do, sir? We Tibers haven't just sat around enjoying ourselves. At least this generation hasn't. We've been at work, fostering relationships with the world's ruling class, improving people's perceptions of Eldians, and keeping track of the events in Parody Island. That said, we neglected to watch our backs. Before we knew it, our enemies had crossed the sea when they were at our necks. I fear that we could find our throats slashed at any moment now. It's become clear that the infiltrators received help from within Marley. And the unsettling truth is that we still don't know who gave it. As you surely know, our motherland Marley has many enemies, even within our own military. And if you want to smoke out your enemies, you light a fire beneath them. We know when and where the foe intends to attack us. That ought to give us the advantage. Unless you have a better one, this is the plan. Even if we can predict their moves, we're putting far too much at stake. We're sacrificing incompetent officers. If the enemy's goal is to damage our military, then so be it. This is an opportunity. Start picking replacements now. The party will approve anyone you choose for your reformed military. But, sir, so many will die. And most will be Eldian civilians. They're the spawn of the devil, aren't they? Don't change on me now, Commander. You've ordered countless Eldians up and over to meet their deaths in a hellscape of barbed wire, landmines, and bullets. So these ones won't be wearing uniforms. That changes nothing. You just need to keep doing what you've always done. Allow me to say one thing. This isn't a war. We don't know our enemies, their goals, or how they plan to attack us. When they make their move, the crowd surrounding you will erupt in chaos. Lord Tiber, if we go forward with this, and use you to bait the enemy, I doubt I'll be able to protect you. They'll do whatever it takes to make sure that you die. Of course. I'm prepared for that. Unless I stand on that stage, the world will not take notice. There must be officers, ambassadors, and journalists from around the globe in that audience. And crucially, the Eldian civilians who are killed myself included, must be mourned by all. <laughs> As victims of an unforeseen attack, if I escaped while my people died en masse, the world would not rally to our cause. Hmm. Hmm? I fully believe the Eldian race was spawned by the devil. But I'm just as sure that we're devils ourselves. <laughs>